Hi, this is Sans from Payroll Hero. Bonuses are a type of payment given to employees who make certain achievements or meet targets set by the company. These may occur frequently, but not on a fixed schedule or fixed amount. An example would be a sales bonus for reaching quarterly or monthly goals. If these goals are not reached, it won't be paid. Another example would be a perfect attendance bonus given to employees with no absences in the month. In Payroll Hero, the bonus template system is used to simplify the process of crediting bonuses to employees. So in this video, you will learn how to create a bonus template per position, then credit it to the employee. Note that for one-time bonus payments or a company-wide bonus payment, it is recommended to create an individual payment or payment template which we will show in another video. So here's how to create a bonus template. First, go to your account settings page. Then on the left side menu, go to the positions page. Select the position that you want to create the bonus template for. Then click on details here at the top. So by default, you are led to the compensation grid here. Now let's go to the bonus templates tab. Then click on the Add a new bonus template button. You will see a Create new bonus template form. Now set the name to identify the bonus. This name will be shown on the system and on the payslip. So for example, you're creating a perfect attendance bonus template. Now select the bank that will keep track of all the payments done for this bonus. If you don't have the relevant bank, then you can create one. Uh, you can see the video on how to add banks. For deferred, if this is enabled, the bonus payment will be deferred. If left unchecked, it will be paid right away. For destination, um, so if you select gross or taxable, this means that the bonus is taxable. If you select net, then it's non-taxable. So this is the destination where the bonus will be credited. So uh, let's say this is a non-taxable bonus. I'll select net. Next is the tax rule. Uh, these tax rules were also previously created. And to learn how to create tax rules, please see the video, How to Add Tax Rules. For this example, we're going to choose non-taxable allowance. Then create the template. And you can see the bonus, perfect, attenda, uh, perfect attendance bonus template we've created here. Now let's go back to the compensation grid. And you will see the updated grid with the bonus added over here. The amount or field, uh, the, uh, field in, the, in this bonus is for reference only. So you can leave it blank or you can add a value as a reminder. So that's how to add a bonus template per position. Now that we've created a bonus template, we can credit it to the employee. So here's how. First, go to the employee list here from your dashboard to so employees, then employee list. The bonus template we created for was for the communications position. So we go to the employee with this position. So for this example, we have Cecil. Then go to his payments page here. Then scroll down and look for the add a new bonus section. So it's over here. From the drop down list, you will see the bonus templates previously created. So this is the one we created earlier. Select the bonus and in the amount field, put the amount that you want to be credited. Then click add. You'll be redirected to a pre-filled new payment page. All the details have been pre-added for you except for the date. 
So select a date by clicking on the field highlighted in red to show the calendar. Then select a date. The bonus will be paid on this date. Remember to select a date within the next pay period to credit it on the employee's next payslip. So after selecting the date, review the settings if you'd like to, and once you are done, you can click Create at the, at the bottom of the page. So these are the details that we previously input when we created the bonus template. Now scroll down here, and you will see that the payment will be added as pending and will be credited when generating the payroll that includes the date selected for the bonus. To verify its status and details, you can view the status column here. And on the payslip, this payment will appear under the bonuses section. Now once this payment has been credited, the status should change to paid. And that's how to create a bonus template and create a payment for employees on Payroll Hero. For more information and details, please check out our knowledge base at support.payrollhero.com. If you have any questions, you can reach us at support at Thanks for watching!